Okay, we're in we're in the greenhouse now. Fabrice, what are we doing here? Having a very, very quick two minute rant on edible flowers. Excellent. So, edible flowers. We're gonna be doing four edible flowers this year for sale through the cafe. Excellent. So we're just doing four common things, yep. which are really, really tough and hardy. Number one, violas. So oh, nice. and violas, edible flowers. We'll be doing a little purple one. Okay, Seems great. Seems really, really cheap and doesn't really need fancy conditions to germinate. Okay. Number one. Number two, <laughs> borage. Borage, great big seeds, really big plant. Once you've got it, it self sows, really attracts the bees, but makes beautiful edible flowers. And these are the purple ones, aren't they? Blue, yeah. Blue. Fading to purple. Yeah. Um, really, really good for the bumblebees. Okay. Number three, nasturtiums. So nasturtiums is really tropiolum, and it's an um, andium plant. It was an old Inca crop. All right. Uh, and it's actually distantly related to cabbage, which is why it's got those peppery tastes in the leaves and the oh, flowers. Okay. So the whole plant is edible, the leaves and the flowers and everything. Okay. They need a bit more warmth to come up, but, because they're not frost hardy, but, you know, start saying them end of this month, beginning of next month. Or very, you very tough seedlings. They'll give you leaves right up to the frosts. Brilliant. And what's the fourth? Fourth one is pot marigold. All right. Again, edible petals, flowers like crazy. Once you've got it, you can't get rid of it. Save them <laughs> to everything. So and we'll be selling these at the in, we'll at be the cafe. Packs of mixed flowers, yeah. Oh, brilliant! Okay, well that so, looks that looks good. Cool. Yeah. All right. Brilliant. Thanks, Fabrice. No worries.